In this video, we will look at where to find the e-textbooks and how to set up an account. Video courses are given free access to any student e-text available for that course. From the Courses tab, the e-textbook link is located on the details of a course. This is an external link that will take the student to the off-site VitalSource website. If the e-textbook link looks like a button, then the Hub account is not linked to a VitalSource account. Moving to the Parent Profile, click on Edit Student. The Linked Accounts box is located on the left-hand side underneath the Customization box. Use the URL address above to create an account on VitalSource. The website will let you know if that email address already exists. Return to the sign-in page and use the forgot password to reset the password. Back on the Hub, once an account has been created on VitalSource, clicking on the button will ask for the email address and password and link the VitalSource account to the Hub. Note, the email address and password are not automatically set up using the same login as the Hub. Once linked, the button will appear grayed out. This process will need to be repeated for each student to allow them access to their e-textbooks. The same VitalSource account can be used for all students. However, VitalSource has a limit of two computers and two mobile devices active per account. If more than two students are using the account, a new account can be created using a different email address and can be linked following these steps. For textbook users who purchased an e-textbook, the link in the course overview will not show up in the Hub. Those purchased e-textbooks will only be available through the VitalSource website or the app for your device. All e-textbooks included in the video courses are a lease, and access to them from the Hub ends when the video course expires. All purchased e-textbooks will expire 16 months from the date of purchase.